Los Angeles County Sheriff's deputies confirming that the woman was in her mid 20s. That parking garage you mentioned right here behind me, she fell off of the top of that third floor there and onto the road beneath us. Uh, I spoke to several employees who work around the corner from where this happened, and they tell me that they often hear stunt and donuts happening in this parking garage. It's quite traumatizing for my sister and I'm assuming for everyone that saw it. Lizbeth Nino was working around 5 o'clock Monday evening when her sister came into the restaurant and told them a female motorist just crashed against a wall on the third level of a parking deck falling on the pavement below. She was parking her car reversing. She said she had her window down and that she heard something loud. Mm -hmm. And the moment she turned around and looked behind her uh, is when she saw the, the young lady on the ground. Los Angeles County Sheriff's deputies received a call saying the motorist was with friends on the top of the parking garage when she lost control of the bike, crashing into the wall, going over the front of the handlebars, then over the wall. The fire department attempted to render aid to her. They transported her to the hospital, and at the hospital she was pronounced deceased. The woman's friend stayed on the scene and told sheriff deputies the group was there to teach her how to ride. I know friends want to teach people, but... If you, you're that interested in, take a professional course. Diego Ramirez works at a sushi bar around the corner from the parking structure and says the garage is known for stunts. Like tire sounds, or even late at night, it's, donuts. it's really random. There's always activities happening like that, uh, donuts upstairs, or even down here, they do try to do donuts. The sheriff's department is working with them all to find video to confirm if she was there to learn how to ride and not doing stunts or donuts. But they say, either way, this is not the place to do it. Both Nino and Ramirez believe more needs to be done by the mall and its security to make sure employees and shoppers are safe. They should probably have more security here or more, at least more officers to try to stop that. But as of right now, it just continues happening. If it's an empty parking structure, it's not always busy, so people take advantage of it. I have reached out to representatives with the mall, but we have yet to hear back from them. The witnesses I spoke to said that they did not see uh, the woman, they did not see her wearing a helmet uh, after she had fallen from on top of the parking garage. Reporting live in Valencia, Pedro Vera, KTLA 5 News. Pedro.